that's a big problem in, in all countries, that uh, many patients think that all drugs are perfectly safe. But it's just like uh, getting on an airplane or traveling by car, that there are risks, that traffic accidents can occur. And what you can do is to try to minimize the risk as much as possible. But I think it's important that we communicate to patients and also to all healthcare providers that drugs cannot be 100% safe because if a drug has an effect, it can also have side a side effect. And I think that message is very important to, to get out and also to the public, of course. Great honor and pleasure to interact with such eminent personalities in the field and some of our guests uh, from foreign countries. Well, uh, I am not really a professional. Uh, uh, anyway, that was on the lighter side. I hope people don't take it seriously. And, uh, you know, I am a military man in uniform. When I say that I can draw some parallels, let me start uh, by telling you uh, a small, you know, example or a small simile about what medical profession in armed forces is like. Uh, there were these three friends traveling in an army or in armed forces. It is very difficult to fight low intensity conflicts, you know, when enemies from within yourself. So I think along with your academic uh, commitment to find out new technologies or new resolution in your field that you are associated with, you will also have to fight elements like greed and corruption and the alike so that the research which is gone into this noble profession does not go waste for very, very small uh, attractions. The, I'm sure everybody associated with this, uh, uh, with this field will do his little bit uh, so that, uh, you know, this, this particular effort uh, does not go waste. Quality of education, we again share the same uh, limitation or same concern, I would say, as, uh, uh, One of the things that pharmacovigilance can do is to discover those drugs which are substandard in some way. It's a matter of quality control and in India there is a very strong wish to establish high professional and scientific standards across everywhere but there are still many manufacturers and street traders and others who are selling drugs which are not of the best quality and indeed some may be actually dangerous. Of Pharmacovigilance of India. This is a national conference. There are also international delegates. Our today's chief guest of the workshop was Mary Lindquist, who is from Sweden, and Mr. Bruce, who is the main speaker today, is from Thailand. The basic of this three-day conference is that the drugs and the side effects of drugs are about the continuous research and the knowledge of the people about them. And amongst the pharmacists, there are different pharmacists, लेटेस्ट जो ड्रग्स के बारे में एडवर्स ड्रग्स रिएक्शन जो एडीआर बोलते हैं उसके बारे में इस कॉन्फ्रेंस का मेन उद्देश्य यही है भी एडीआर के बारे में कंप्लीट रिसर्च और उससे रिलेटेड बातों का पता लगे Thank you.